Welcome to MathSeason.com. Let's take a look at this problem. At 6 a.m., car A left town X for town Y. At the same time, car B left town Y for town X. At 10 a.m., the two cars passed each other. Two hours after they had passed each other, car A reached town Y, but car B was still six, 300 kilometers away from town X. Find the distance between town X and town Y. Scenario 1 In 4 hours, car A had reached the meeting point at 10 a.m. after leaving at 6 a.m. from town X. Meanwhile, car B left town Y at 6 a.m. and reached meeting point at 10 a.m. after 4 hours. Next scenario Car A had moved on to town Y by 12 noon whereas car B had only reached point Q by 12 noon still with 300 kilometers to go. Let's assume car B travels at unit per hour or U divided by H. Therefore one U is the distance covered by car B in one hour. In six hours car B travels the distance from S, which is town Y, to Q, which is the point reached at 12 noon, but car B still has 300 kilometers to travel. So after 6 hours, 6 plus 300 kilometers is equal to 6U plus 300, which is the distance between points P and S, or between town X and town Y. That means car A traveled the entire distance within 6 hours, but car B still had 300 kilometers distance here to travel. The difference in distance covered by hour is equal to 300 divided by 6, or 50 kilometers per hour. Therefore, car A was traveling 50 kilometers per hour faster than car B. For car A, unit plus 50 kilometers per hour, from 6 a.m. to 10 a.m., distance by car A is equal to 4 multiplied by U plus 50 is equal to 4U plus 200. Distance by car B, 4 times U, is equal to 4U. Total distance by both cars, which covers the total distance between town X and town Y, is equal to 4U plus 200 plus 4U is equal to 8U plus 200. Therefore, 8U plus 200 represents the total distance between town X and town Y as covered by car A and car B during the first four hours. We know that car A traveled the entire distance between town X and town Y in a total of six hours, but after six hours, car B still had a distance of 300 kilometers yet to travel. In other words, car B to travel from town Y to town X can be expressed as 6U plus 300 kilometers. Therefore, the total distance travel in the first four hours by both cars is the same as the total distance that car B needs to cover in total. Therefore, the distance rec represented by both our expressions are equal. 8u plus 200 and 6u plus 300. If we solve that equation, 8u plus 200 is equal to 6u plus 300. If we solve for u, we get 2u is equal to 100 or u is equal to 50. So 6 times u is equal to 6 times 50 is equal to 300 kilometers. 6u plus 300 is equal to 300 plus 300 is equal to 600 kilometers. Total distance between town X and town Y is equal to 600 kilometers. Answer check. Car A, total distance 600 kilometers covered in 6 hours is equal to a speed of 100 kilometers per hour. We know that car A travels at a speed that is 50 kilometers per hour faster than car B. Therefore, the speed of car B is equal to 100 minus 50, or 50 kilometers per hour. In 6 hours, car B would travel 6 times 50 is equal to 300 kilometers. 
if the total distance between town X and Y as per our answer is 600 kilometers and car B traveled 300 kilometers in the first six hours and still has 300 kilometers to go, our answer is therefore correct. We hope you enjoyed this video. Visit mathseason.com again for more videos on fun and challenging math problems.